law itself. We honor and appreciate the role judges, district attorneys, and, and parole officers play in the criminal justice system. We have and will continue to consult with them as we fine tune the language of the bill and to create a solution that works from big city Philadelphia to York, Pennsylvania, and to the towns and suburbs that surround them. The goal is to move deserving parolees out of the system and allow those in law enforcement to focus on higher risk offenders and other more important priorities. Lastly, this bill is about opportunity. Yes, there are many egregious offenders who will not and should not be paroled, but that's not who we're talking about here. America truly is the land of opportunity. It is the land of second chances. And the last I checked, we've all needed a second chance somewhere in life. I know I certainly have. Yeah. It's an honor to be here, and I look forward to working with Representatives Delosier and Harris as we finalize and pass this bill and offer our friends and neighbors a shot at redemption. With that, I'd like to introduce my colleague, Representative Ed Ganey from Allegheny County. Good afternoon, Philadelphia. How you doing? Right. Come on, Philly, give it to me. I'm from the city of Pittsburgh. Right. They told me this is the city of brotherly love. City of Philadelphia, how you doing? Right. Yeah, that's what I want to hear. Before I say anything, Sister, can we give a big hand right? to my leader in the house, J Representative Jordan Harris, right. the Democratic whip. Come on, we can do better than that. Give him a big hand. Right. Philadelphia today is a good day. It's a day that we come together as a commonwealth to talk about something that for so long has plagued and injured so many people. I've often told people, we don't need criminal justice reform, we need criminal justice reconstruction. Because at the end of the day, we got to give lives back to the lives that we've taken. Okay. We have made it a way for people to enter into recidivism without elevating their skills and helping them to live a better day in America. Right. Coming out with felonies and misdemeanors, things that prevent them from getting employment, from hindering them from getting housing. That's this right. got to stop. If this is the American way, then we got to change it back to the dream of America that tells everybody that you are eligible for a second chance, that in the land of the milk and honey, you can live free even after you do your sins. Amen. Today is the day for a new beginning. Bipartisan support throughout this commonwealth. And if we, as people, really want to put humanity first, if we really want to see the change in criminal justice, then join us at the state capitol. And let's make sure that everybody has a chance to life. Thank you. Woo!